Hi, I'm Olivia Race, AMGA instructor team member. There are times when we're belaying that we need to go hands-free. If I'm using a grigri, that's a pretty easy thing to do. All I have to do is tie a knot behind my device. Many times we'll be belaying with something like a reverso, so there's a little bit more to locking this device off. I'm gonna pass a bite through the carabiner. So I have a bite right here, and then I'm gonna pass another bite through the first bite and lock that onto the spine of the carabiner. So that's bringing the rope back into the correct breaking orientation. And since that's just a half hitch, I'm gonna finish it off with an overhand around the load strand. When we're ready to climb again, I'm gonna undo my overhand knot. And here I just wanna be careful that I don't pinch my fingers and that I also don't drop my climber. So I'm gonna pull that slack through till it's almost out. And I'll let Dale know that I'm gonna, he might feel a pop while I do this. And then I pull it quickly and maintain my break hand. And then we're back to belaying. There are lots of reasons why you might have to tie off a device while you're belaying. Uh, maybe your partner needs another piece of gear on the route. Maybe they're injured and I need to start initiating a rescue. Or I need to keep my toddler away from the tarantula that he's found. Or I need a selfie.